I'm alive. Who to cling to when the rain set oh, in. Yeah, I'm and I would have liked to have known you, but I was just a kid. Your candle burned out long before your legend yeah. ever did. Next. <laughs> Just candle and the wind. Never know. So now I'm just looking at the camera and uh, just. When the rain fell. I would have liked to have known you, but I was just. You can't remember how long before you left me. Alright, subject number one, adult kids suck. Adult kids sucks. Yes. Explain to me what I mean. Mm. What do we mean? Well, you love them. You love your kids. You love your everybody. adult kids. Everybody. I think every everybody loves them. But what do, we, what, what do we mean when we say adult kids suck? Uh, mostly Explain adult adult kids sucks because uh, they make their own choices. Right, and these choices, are they good choices usually? Yeah, mostly they do a bad choices. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> not, not, don't know how to be, you know, be lessened. So, even you said uh, no, but for them it's yes. If you said not okay, but for them it's okay. So, like for example, number one, uh, you're not allowed to drink because you're still you know underage but they did oh you mean like, because they're 18 yeah and like they're adults like but in america we have a drinking age of 21 right and it's pretty it's pretty hard to get around it um, i'm sure everyone does but i'm just saying that uh you're not supposed to but here in the Philippines, they don't really have a drinking age. My God, I seen a kid the other day. Yeah, they don't have. Uh, uh, his Lolo sent him to the Seven Eleven. I think the kid. Hi, was like the seven. dragon mama. Hello, good morning, and good evening. Uh, continue. Well, ask. No, I don't. You're, uh, you're talking to them. Yeah, first. Not me. Yeah, this is our first. First. Visitor. Yeah, I know. Yeah, first visitor. Welcome to our channel and our live stream your show yeah. not our my my show i mean my show the fell it's show. a night for me yeah uh, that is why uh frank and i we talk about do the live uh today here because the daytime and at least there it's a night time so listen real quick idea. part of what you're supposed to do is speak about ldr dating oh uh, yeah -cat relationships anyway uh, our topic today is about uh, LDR. Yes. And uh, with Filipina from Western yeah. Canada, America. LDR with um, uh, Filipina. Uh, what else? Uh, How old are you? Me. Yeah. I am forty-one. Okay. And, and how many kids I do you have? I have four kids. My eldest is twenty-one, and my youngest is. Uh, ben. Now interact so, with them. Ask them a question. Who is it? This is a uh, dragon. Dragon mama. Okay, good. Good morning. Hi, B. Finally, we try to do uh -oh. a vlog. Okay. Uh, yes, morning. yes. I like that. So I'm kinda young though. Uh, it's okay. We have actually, uh, Rachel. Yeah. Rachel's an avid watcher. She's actually, what, our like I said, our well, topic is uh, about LDR. So, uh, if you want, uh, if you have some no, no, questions that's about the suggested LDR, topic. You can talk yeah. about anything. Remember, you're here to entertain. So, if you have some questions about LDR or about uh, me and Frank, where we're gonna meet, something like that, you free to uh, you free to us. I know, right? Hello, well, finally got you guys. Yeah, because last night, B, <laughs> I a friend. Well, number so one, good. Mike bailed on us. He's yeah. sick. He's not feeling so, good. So yeah, we're supposed to be uh, uh having a live today with Mike. Mike with a PPL, but uh, he's not feeling well. So 
since Frank and I, we have a free time, so we just uh, uh, do the live today for all those uh, subscribers that didn't catch up last night. So this is for you guys. Well, more to the point, you're hoping you try to get some Western yeah. audience. So, because the I'm kind of young. It's okay if you're young. Actually, we have a baby member here. Uh, I have subscribers. She is 11 years old. I know. Uh, yes. Hello. Hi, Mandia. Okay. Man, we are looking forward to it. <laughs> so, yeah. Actually, we do that uh, tomorrow, B, uh, because Mike canceled that today. So, we do tomorrow My God, morning, there's even a Facebook advertisement. Yes. So, uh, we do that uh, tomorrow. And then, we do live today and maybe little tonight again for the uh, Filipino person uh filipino subscribers even though uh westerners as long as uh they are available during the night time or morning time either way so because this is, you could call this a test yeah it's just a test it depends like i said so last night uh we do i think almost one hour uh live because my partner is so exhausted and even me a little bit because yesterday we went to 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 Bacolod to pick up uh Frank's uh, package and then it's very you know exhausted very hot the, the waves were really the wave high the waves really really bad the boat cannot you know stay what's it called that it was rocking yeah, all over in, like, it was rocking almost, and rolling so rocking and rolling all oh, that's a bit scary long. But uh, we move on now, so we're in good mood, especially me. How are you? Where is the uh, dragon from? Uh, anyway, your uh, dra dragon, if you're still here, uh, where you came from. Actually, you said it's a night time there. So, it doesn't matter. They can yeah. still say where they're from. Maybe Duh. somewhere. <laughs> so, yeah. B, I know where, he, where she came from. So I have four right now and one like. Thank you, Dad, for the one like. And maybe even winter is still there. So hello. Winter probably is there. I think yeah. she was looking <laughs> forward to. Hi, Smurf. How you doing? I'm doing good. And I think you already know that we're supposed to be. I with told him on WhatsApp. Okay. So wow. So that is why we are here. Doing I was disappointed. Our own I'm in that. Remember no, I, mean, that? I was disappointed. I was looking forward to it. Okay. My God, we have a Facebook thing where I look all tough. I'm glad you guys made it home safe. Yeah. Um, five. I. Hello. Hello, Smurf. So, yes, be actually, <laughs> even me, I feel started to, I uh, know, to, to upset stomach because I'm not really fun with the uh, you know the wave even a long trip i have morning uh not morning sickness morning sickness morning motion sickness so most of the time i have that so actually i take a medicine i know smurf is uh click the button so thank you smurf so most of the time i take a medicine before uh, i'm do traveling maybe airplane or cars or both as always smurf you're welcome you have said so again if you hear that we were thinking about uh talking about ldr hi phil kamusta ka philip masi philip masi hi phil kamusta ka okay lang okay lang ako I'm fine. I'm good. I'm happy. I'm in good mood. Uh, anyway, Philip, where which you came from? Because he's talk as a Tagalog, so maybe it's she just here me. from from the Philip. Hey, look. Here's the thing. Only what? reference me when you need me. Otherwise, engage your audience. <laughs> I know. I'm just like you want to sit there. Okay, just supervise there. Okay. That's, I'm here for help if you need it. Yeah. So thank you for switch up the AC because I'm freezing. I'm I'm freezing. 
I'm super praising. Imagine that I'm just and, and actually today I feel bad because uh we are a lot of laundry today, but we out of water supply from the city. I don't know. It's already but since morning. So Your well I'm, dried up too. What? Your well. Yeah, and our up. well is also dry, so dry I mean, so I was thinking that uh how long that the water supply is gonna go back because you look so strange just li literally on the bottom of the screen let's try to get you to where okay. you're at so i was thinking that and worried that uh what time the water supplies back because like i said our uh, i was worried about a water our water pump for the heater because it if we out of the water it, it's uh the water probably is turning very long so maybe it still don't have a water supply I'm gonna switch off the main uh, the 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 tank at the water pump to avoid to getting burned and LDR how did you and Frank it in touch when he was still in US uh, let's go a little deeper where did we meet where did you meet that's bad I already we met at Filipino Cupid and hold on if i how am i gonna check okay so that's the first questions ldr how did you frank keep in touch when he was still in the u.s mm, actually i didn't work and you had a lot of free time we stayed yeah, online he didn't, he didn't, all the time he didn't work and i didn't have work and then we have multiple uh up to use if he's not available in skype we talk in whatsapp messenger so we talk 24 7 actually be even though i do some chores i put my phone down there if i do cooking i bring my phone into the kitchen put the, the phone down while i'm cooking or while i'm doing laundry so he's always uh uh supervise me with everything what i do even i'm sleeping sometimes so i off my my messenger until I fall asleep until and I woke sounds, up in the wait, morning. Hold on, time out, time out. That sounded a little weird. I supervise you. No, you were supervising me too. Yeah, we are both supervise each other. Sometimes he fall asleep and still the 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 phone is still on. What are problem that could be real trouble? Yes, actually smart because like I said, that uh Philippines is right now experiencing El Nino, so there are. So certain area here in philippines that they really uh uh dried no water supply at all especially when we were in Guimaras, so that number of problem there is also water so here right now just like i said so no water supply since uh, uh I, I think six o'clock so until now they don't have water so manang joy she do laundry and then she stopped because she find out that we don't have a water supply let me check if it for you let me check it for you now nagpuyo ko sa united states <laughs> wow nagpuyo i understand the words puyo nagpuyo ko sa united states actually the words for you is very uh diff I'm not sure it's a Tagalog, uh, Bisaya, or... Uh, Are you really a Philippine woman? <laughs> again, Filipinas is different. There are certain languages here. So the words Puyo is... I think they also use that also in Ilonggo, but we are not really uh, use that deep words Puyo. So he said that Nagpuyo ko sa United States. So he said that he was living in United States. So that's Philip said. Phil is definitely a uh, far sighted. Your glasses form real image, not virtual one. Actually, this is a this is a reading read. This is a reading glass. My my subscribe. I my subscribe. My my prescriptions. Prescriptions. Uh, uh, glasses is here. So sorry about that. <laughs> so if I use this, I can read more uh if it, it's closer right this one i can read even far 
if even close. So I think I'm gonna use this. Okay. Uh, your glass for is in is not bird for once and fell. I've sent you the link on Messenger. I got it and I flirted with her. Dip hiligainon. Yeah. That's right, B. We are not really used the words puyo. We are not really used to. Hey, it's like my joke about the word mumbahai. Yeah, even the words. Actually, the, the words uh, uh, mabuhai. Like, for example, they have, like you, you came from United States and you arrive or you are a visitor and then there are some uh, government or local people who just uh, pick you up in the airport and then, uh, uh, hi, hi, sir, bro. welcome to the Philippines, mabuhay, something, that's like a welcoming, okay. mabuhay, something like that. But uh, for me, just like I said, for day-to-day -day, uh, uh, talk or something, we are not really used the words mabuhay, even you can ask B. Right, B? We're not really used to words mabuhay. So you look like an idiot running around saying mabuhay. Oh, oh. Ako ay mula sa United States. <laughs> oh, oh. Ako ay mula sa United States. Are you using the... The... Philip using a... Google Translation. Google Translation. Something like that. So, be, uh, be agree. Yes. Oh, oh. Ako ay mula sa United States. Yes. Yeah, I came from United States. So, I think... Where? Where in the yeah, United where, States? Yeah, which part in United States? Frank is from Virginia. Right? Missouri now. Yeah, you have... Um, actually, you, you, you're born in... Virginia. Virginia? I thought it's not you. You're not born in Virginia. No, I was born in Virginia. I grew up in Oklahoma, and then I went to school in Missouri. Then I moved to Virginia, and then my stuff has now moved all the way to. So Missouri. your life is just like all over the all place. over the place. So it's called here in Philippines in PE. Ah. No permanent address. <laughs> No for the next You can talk person. to me all the time. So yeah. I still um you know. Ang wikang Filipino sa Google Translate Tagalog ba ito? Yes, the words ang wikang Filipino is a uh, Tagalog words. But you know Tagalog, so Yeah, okay. but I know how I know how to speak Tagalog. Actually, uh Every word, uh, yes, Tagalog. Actually, Tagalog is just easy to to learn and to understand than the different language. Even me, it's difficult for me to understand the the Ilocano. If you live in somewhere in Luzon, like Ilocos, so they speak Ilocano there. That's uh. Ilocano for me, it's even I heard that many times or I read that many times, but it's hard for me to to remember some of those words. So for me, it's the most uh, easy words to learn is uh, Tagalog because when you learn Tagalog, if you're going to Cebu, if you're going here in Iloilo, if you're going in uh, Dabao. So you can still speak Tagalog because it's just easy to communicate if you just speak Tagalog. So that's my that's my advice. Instead, you just uh, learning every languages. Just must prefer that you learn Tagalog because if you're going in, in the, hey, saan saan ba ang sakayan ng jeep? If you are in Iloilo, still people can understand you and still can give you direction even you just uh, ask the fish. Uh, questions uh using tagalog even english though don't worry about about uh, uh you don't know how to speak tagalog you don't know how to speak bisaya if you're english it's just easy because people in philippines uh, know how to speak english karamihan ba sa mga pilipino ay marunong ng tagalog o sila ba ay lub dalubhasa sa kanilang mga local na dialecto sa halip um 
Actually, yes. Yes. Mostly. But you know, you know what? Kids nowadays have a hard time learning Filipino in school because they got used to speak and reading English. Mostly B does happen if this, if your kids is enrolled in private school. But if you enroll your kids in public school, they still have... Uh, remember grade 1 to grade 3, they have um, mother tongue. So they still, they still learn how to speak, uh, especially they use a mother tongue. So especially here in Iloilo, they're they're from grade one to grade three they have some mother tongue lessons that the the questions and the books is still written by uh and so i mean hiligaynon ilunggo i mean so but if you enroll your kids in private school mostly these they they talk english that's what johanna said for, to me that you know, Mama, some of my classmates, even our subject is Filipino, they, they, uh, they don't understand some of those uh, Tagalog. So yeah, for some uh, kids' generation right now, mostly because the influence of internet, uh, they are more, more English. But people who just like us be, I can still, most Filipinos can speak Tagalog. Yes, excellent. My goodness. I don't think I can talk Tagalog that well. Yeah, actually, Smurf is really good. Actually, Frank, before he came here, he just bought a Tagalog book. And before he just uh, learned how to, to, to speak a little bit Ilongo about direction uh, go straight go forward turn to the left turn to the right go backward something like that uh drink uh what else uh thing uh salamat mahal kita he just learned tagalog first just like uh umi inom umi inom is a uh, is a tagalog words in Ilonggo, you just uh, inom, something like that. So mostly, uh, I will teach him at, at Tagalog words like lalaki, babae. The words of lalaki is a uh, boy. It's a boy, and babae it's a girl. girl. So if you speak that in Ilonggo, lucky, not uh, not lalaki. That's a lucky. That's a bayi. So. Oh no! A, shit! You didn't tell me that. Because I would have enjoyed that. Lucky. Lucky. Yeah, I can live with that. That's a lot easier. So, like, for example, I ask you, you, you have sons. So, yeah. uh, um, uh, Frank's a son, uh, as a boy or a girl. Babayi or lalaki? Or bahi or lucky? L A K K I, something like that. Yes, the. Google no at all. Yeah, sometimes, but sometimes uh, if you translate the the Tagalog, you ask the Tagalog in like for example, you use translation and then you ask this in Google from Tagalog to to English. There are there are times that it's a wrong. Sometimes um, Google is a give you a wrong uh, informations about the the Tagalog. The what is this? Uh, Oracle? Movies? The camera is just like that. I remember that movie. You remember the movie though? The Oracle was from uh, The Matrix. It's not accurate. Yep. The answer might from the matrix i watched matrix but i'm not really understand just like it. understand it yeah i that's the that's the thing if you watch the movie you're supposed to be star when you watch the about the matrix there are three movies i think so you start from the first one and the second one 
And because if you watch the second one, that's for me, that's uh, even right now, even if we watch that, I it's hard for me to understand the story at all. Unless Frank uh, tell me about the about the story. So B wants to go to karaoke on Saturday night for my birthday. Is your birthday on Saturday? Yeah, duh. I enjoyed I the original Matrix movie, but they went downhill quickly from there. That's true. Most most part two, three, four stuff kind of does. I mean, let's just super, super into it. But you like my Matrix, right? Yeah. Well, I mean, the first one was, again, you, you, you're, you've never seen the Matrix. You, you know what I mean? Like, the whole storyline's pretty cool. After that, they're always kind of reaching. You know what I mean? Like, they're... Uh, trying to make something out of nothing, I think. Mm. It's still good. I mean, it's still Matrix, but you know what I mean? Like, sometimes I think it just goes a little too far. Today, the Matrix is live in America. I'm trying to walk up from it and go to the Philippines. Man, that's a funny, funny uh, analogy, but yeah. true. That's what I had to do, Smurf. That's why I came here. I escaped the Matrix. I woke up, I, I unplugged, and... Came to the Matrix, sold everything. Yeah, like... In that computer weird program. But you know what? Um, happy early birthday, friend. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. So, thank you. like I said, uh, most Filipino, they want you, to... You didn't even know it was my birthday. Do you know how, how old am I turning? 53. Okay, you got that right. No, I don't... I don't uh, look... Sorry, I, I didn't mean to Sunday, interrupt you. It was just funny. Sunday. It's Saturday. We looked at this. Remember, we looked before. Yeah. Okay. If that's Saturday, yeah, we go to KTV. Are Smallville, you Smallville. There's there's several karaoke. Just I don't like to go the the KTV. That's chaos. I think they have a room for let just like like for example, we have a group and then we just go that just like a private room for you know for that group and do KTV. I think we have idea for that. I am was fantastic. Is that sequel same? Smurfs word? referring to all the movies that have a really good sequel. I like Terminator. Does Arnold Schwarzenegger starts? He's right. Actually, even some of the new Alien movies, like uh, oh, what was that one? Prometheus. I really like Prometheus. Do I watch that with you though? There's I one in Smallville. B, I thought there were several in Smallville, but sure. No, I mean, I asked Bia yeah, about the, just like a private. Not, oh, okay, yeah, okay, okay. Like I know that. what you mean. Just like uh, that you can go inside. Uh, or the version 21 until we can make a reservation. Ooh, that would be nice. I haven't done that yet. That'd be a good vlog. Just we do it? Yeah, if you want, why not? We don't have any plan yet. So, yeah. And the kids have no excuse, so... It's Frank birthday. We're going out. Duh. Yeah. Actually, that's a good idea. You know what? You look really cute today. I like your look. Because... Yeah. You took a nice shower. You were ready to do the live. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just preparing for some... That I wonder why. Just like... Because I don't read a mic message I get in my messenger. So, I'm just... Quick, after I have just prepared our breakfast together, I said, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make a quick breakfast for both of us so after that i eat quick and then jump to the shower and then uh change my uh change my clothes and everything and then i'm just ready now why frank is still on the phone why he's not getting hurry i thought we have mics this morning something like that and then i find out that mike is just canceled the uh, the live today so, ah and then you didn't tell me, so I will be talk a I, I meant to, but I was kind of letting you go, because I knew I was going to do this to you. So yeah. I thought to myself, the more ready you got, the better you'd be for this. Okay. I like your hair like that, Phil. I'm trying to Favorite be... quote from Alien. Game over, man. Game over. What are we going to do now? What are we going to do? Let's, Let's build do... a fire. Sing a couple songs. Maybe that will help. Them. Wow, he's got a good memory. Yeah. Was that Bill Paxton? Because that sounds like Bill Paxton. He'd be like, what are we going to do? What are we going to do now? What are we going to do? Let's build a fire, sing a couple songs. 
Maybe that will uh, help. What movie is that, though? The Alien. Alien. Bill Paxton always said, he's, of course, he's passed away, so rest in peace. But he always sounded like he was whining whenever he was like, oh, no, man. Oh, I know. I do, too. The funniest Bill Paxton movie there was Chet when he was uh, Weird Science and they turned him into a big pile of shit before that was like an emoji, but it looked just like the emoji, you know, that poop emoji. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so imagine yeah. Bill Paxton, a, an actor, is dressed up or in some kind of a, a poop emoji long before, you know, emoji was a thing. Hey, so congratulations. You have seven people. I'm not sure where they're from, but you're doing well. Yeah. Cutie right, pie. Right, yes, so. and by the way, I like your hair like that too. Like I said, I'm just trying to to, to to let my hair like this. So since it's growing so fast, remember it's two months after I've just uh, cut it again, but never do that again. I let my hair really, really, you know, grow back because I miss my hair too bad. Too bad that I was just cut my hair so very, very short. Hey Vasquez, have you ever been mistaken for a man? Vasquez, no have you. You heard that too? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Vasquez is the uh, it's the little tough lady on Alien. And uh, somebody was joking with her because she looks like a little man. Mm -hmm. Right, and so it's like, hey Vasquez, has anybody ever uh, mistaken you for a man? So this isn't a slight at you. This is a slight about the uh, actress who played Vasquez mm. in the movie Aliens. Well, we know what's the favorite of his, right? Yes, that was Bell Paxton. Bill Paxton. Bell Paxton. Yep. I had a feeling even the dialogue sounded like Bill I, Paxton. I don't really... Uh, some of those uh, uh, character or the actor, I don't uh, know them. So that's why sometimes uh, I don't know that. I, I don't like watch that movie because I don't know those character or the actor or actress or something like that. And just like I said, I was just grew up with, you know, no no TV. I was just really, um, uh, I think I was in high school that I already, uh, started to watch and rent just like we used the DVD before. So yeah, just was renting that. I don't remember any of that. LOL, it has been a while since I watched the movie. Well, I have to do science fiction Friday once I get a real TV in the Philippines. Science. I hate science though. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I don't say that I, I'm just, I'm just, uh, uh, I hate science, but you know, Smurf, since I was a kid, I really like those some stuff, just like, you know, uh, if something broke in the bicycle, I'm just really how to, you know, to fix it, and then even our radio is broken, <laughs> I just like to fix it, like, electricity something like that i'm just it's like uh i'm not more in science but i know how to be being a handy handy woman i also help you know build do some carpenters we'll have to do uh, this sounds good i have to keep myself from falling asleep though One more quote about the little girl. New and the alien will survive for weeks. Huh? Ripley Hudson. The little girl survived longer. The weapons. Than that with no weapons and training. Ripley, right? I can't. We got to keep scrolling it up. Hudson, why don't you put her in charge? <laughs> Laugh a little, that one's Yeah, cool. just like smurf or uh, memorize all the... Yeah, well, that was one of the later aliens, too. Like, yeah. Like, that wasn't, like, the first one. Because there's a lots of movie That's what I'm aliens. saying. There's a whole lot yeah. of versions. They also, uh, I remember the alien one is the black guy, the actor. Who is that? 
the just like the Independence Day. Samuel L, the black guy. Samuel Jackson. Yeah. I had a tradition when I lived in Boston where I would play quietly science fiction movies and watch with friends. Whoa. You like science though. <laughs> Always. Science Science Fridays. I sometimes I just watch that like in um Discovery though or what the what's the other channel? I'm not sure like Ge Ge geographic channel something like that. But mostly I like the to watch just uh just like our planets, animals, plants, more on natures that I just really like to 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 watch different kind of uh, trees so that's why friends sometimes oh i know that trees oh i know this kind of plants because as i grew up in you know province villages so most of those plants and trees i know them it's a good for watch movie with a group of friends yeah i agree mostly uh, we watch a movie here in the room we invite the kids we watch together but mostly of course me and frank going to the movie theater watch a movie i missed a couple comments again where is it we'll have to do science fictions friday once i get rltv in the philippines i think i was read that Yes, that was Bill Paxton. Paxton, I already read that. Hey, Vasquez, have you ever been mistaken for a man? Vasquez, no, have you? I will read this. We'll have to do science fictions Friday once I get a real TV, real TV in the Philippines sounds good i have to keep myself from falling asleep though lol one more quote about that little girl mute in the alien who survived for weeks i think frank's already read this mm, reply hudson this little girl survived longer than that with no weapons weapons and no training reply right private hansen why don't you put here in charge and then i will read that i had a tradition when i lived in boston where i would play quality a quality, quality science fiction, science fiction movies, movies and, and watch, watch, with, friends. With, watch okay. with friends sci-fi so sci fridays, sci fridays. It's good to watch movies with a group of friends, yes. yes. You missed a couple of my comments. You got the comment, thank you. Ah. Yeah. Hey Smurf, what are you gonna do when she gets really big and there's like there's like a whole bunch that she's gonna miss? <laughs> like yeah. hold on a minute. You won't I'm be able to do that, Phil. Right. Like if you had a whole bunch of people yeah, you like, wouldn't just like I said, sometimes it's my, I don't ask to be like a lot just like it's better to be have some couple comments something like that yes i like those documentary show as well and engineering show also there are lot there are lots of good channel on youtube for yes actually you just like my my brother though she ha uh, he has some of boxes in the house and then all the other michelle and then when i open the box all the box that uh all the storage box i've opened it is just a more uh box for my brother because um he's uh electronic engineering and then my sister is, is a chemical engineer so i've just compared that two boxes that they have so at michelle because it's chemical, most all different, and then Kuya Jojo is also way different. There's a lot of, you know, different kind of numbers, something. Oh, wow, this is, 
really that's what that's why they said that engineer course is not really easy even if you see the books that they have in the house I also like to watch uh, what this one also related in uh, documentary about just like an Egyptian thing something like that no you already got the comment yeah thank you yeah, I like documentaries like Engineering Giants or how they manufacture different stuff and food. Those are interesting. Yeah, B, actually, uh, I like that. That's why when we when I watch that, which is uh, how they're going to... First things that I was watching is about the spam, which what kind, uh, what part of the the... The watch part of the pork they do, you know, uh, cutting to make uh, spam, something like that. Ancient Egypt. I didn't see that one William have to check it out. <laughs> to read that bit. Well, my stomach. And also, I like to watch the um uh cooking cooking stuff so that's why i've learned some of the 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 menu that i'd never 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 my mom never my mom and dad never teach that but i'm uh only watching for some videos and then i'm just trying to learn it actually first things that i just watch is how to make a perfect uh what's the favorite breakfast you want that you really miss biscuits and gravy uh, biscuits and gravy i've been trying that twice but the biscuits, not sweat it. i'll just have to chill out and not sweat it <laughs> the the brisket is Frank, because she's looking a little bit floppy, right? Mine is a little bit hard, so <laughs> I don't know. It's maybe I use extra. Uh, what's the ingredients that I forget to? So that that the Frank said, oh, the taste is good, but it's a little bit hard. So he wants a, a floppy briskets. I just have to learn to chill out and spread it. You need rising. <laughs> dough the dough rising self rising we don't have that here in the philippines what is that well just... remember we talked about using baking soda to make it more fluffy yeah it has a little of that automatically in it i think so my, my point is is they have self rising flour in the united states oh because i've used uh all purpose flour try and try it. that's the one thing about baking yeah that's true you just try one Let's try again, try again. Each time you do it, you're a little better. You're yeah, actually, little better. sometimes you perfect it. Sometimes I'm really impressed, Frank, that we have we do baking. More. But actually, even at the bakeries here in the Philippines, there's still no, you know, like fresh biscuits. There's no biscuits that are compared to like you know, any biscuit in America. Yeah, about baking though, Frank is really good in that. Even in United States, you do a uh, he make a uh, squash bread, right? I mean, that's squash bread um, muffins. I mm, know, uh, yes, so yeah, muffins. just muffins. That he do like baking. We just make and and that biscuits. They easy to make. Relaxing and scent Egyptian music in high river ambience. Strange heart sleep study uh, meditations. Actually. Uh, sometimes if Frank and I um, done to watch a movie and then we're ready to you know to go to sleep, he just uh, put one of music. Actually, different kind, right? He just use sometimes uh, an ocean or sometimes raining thing music, something like that. Finally, come here! I have a surprise for you. Come on. 
I want you to read this. Literally, I just laid okay. down. Like what? Because winter. <laughs> I never tried this, but uh, ready, you can convert all purple flour into soap. Rising flour. Hi, by winter. Whisk together one cup all purpose flour. I can't. Mm, hold on. I, I need camera to to screenshot this. One cup all purpose flour and 1.5 teaspoon of baking powder and one per teaspoon of salt. Oh, really? I don't know this. Okay, I'm gonna try this. Lola. Can I do Lola or maybe just just a mom? I don't like call you Lola. Maybe Johanna and Siren calls you Lola Winter, but me. Maybe I could ask my mommy Winter. Nanai. Or maybe Nanai. Or my Nai. Nanai. Nai. Nanai Winter. You like those type of music. When, winter, what will do you do? Spring it tomorrow? Spring? Here is a very hot. So yeah, finally, Winter, thank you so much for the first comment though. I appreciate it. Do search for the William. It's extremely relaxing. It has a purple pyramid or two on the screen. You heard that? The search for the William. It's extremely purple pyramid. It is the first day of spring tomorrow for you guys. Yeah, first day the, the spring derby, but here is still super, super hot, my God. I just buy salt rising flour, all purpose, to la too lazy to convert anything. Hello, Frank and Phil in chat. Yay! Hey. Thank you so much. <laughs> Finally, Frank, she did it. It's because of the time of day. I have this to. This is why I told you to do this time. Huh? And now we know that if I just do like, like this morning, like nine o'clock, up to I think eleven. Tell her the truth. Your feelings were hurt because all you could do was look. <laughs> You're the but one. But she was girl. talking to Mike. But she always just. I have to excuse myself for a bit. Little guys need it ready for school. Get ready for school. Ah, your son is a uh, hapunan shabi. Maybe enjoy your singing. Yeah, actually, uh, winter we invite B this uh, Saturday, Saturday, night. Saturday night because it's his birthday. So maybe we go out, do some, you know, uh, uh, karaoke, something like that. Maybe at that time you're gonna hear me sing. Hopefully, <laughs> because that's Frank's birthday, so maybe I could sing. Let's see. Yes, I can be your mom and the baby fam. Maybe more Frank, Ati or Manang or Tita. Oh, you can call her Manang, Manang, Manang Winter. Why well, you really good in the? Please, so yeah, here we. Actually, the words, uh, like I said, that the words of Apo, Manang, Tita, Ati. So, yeah, I like that. Uh, if you call Ati or Manang, is that the way how you be uh, called or giving uh, respect for your elder brother or eldest brother? Manong for the brother and Manang for the sister. Yeah, uh, calling Tita or Tito for you know even relative or not relative, but this is also the Filipino way how to giving respect for elders, men, and women. So, yeah, yeah. You called winter manang, manang winter, but I really. To Nanai, <laughs> my Nanai, my Nanai went because could it talk my Nanai just 
like I talk when they're like this. So yeah, my nana right now, he she do is just like repeat say and then more love. Uh, she was diagnosed for uh, Alzheimer and she has a dementia and Alzheimer's for almost four years now. Uh, no, no, almost five years. And then it's uh, getting worse because uh, uh, before uh, she it by her own, but now we were always uh, feeding here because it she it all by herself. She do is just chewing and chewing, but did never swallow the food. Or sometimes she just uh, 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 what you call this? Uh, did not really eat good. So sometimes she forgot that she she just eating. So the food is stay long. Her mother chewing, chewing, chewing. If you don't remind her to swallow the food, she don't uh, she don't do it. But I'm fine with winter. Okay, actually I like. The name winter i just bought lola for johanna mostly i don't want her to worry some kid is sweeping her <laughs> yeah actually um that's a good idea so yep good Just like I said that the one time I've just uh uh what you call before before I've been noticed before Nana be, be, before she really got the dementia first thing she do is uh like more on walking more on walking 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 and then she never she never she never sleep and she never get tired. Frank, did you get? that's what's up link to forward to william you heard that what uh smurf said did you get the what's up link to forward to william forward to forward b i think some the name was a male name winter yeah actually i thought uh you are a and because of your name so just like before, I don't know who really he is. He uh, he's a male or she is a female. We don't know, but yeah, I like the name Winter. Um, uh, I think Smart Frank don't read the message that I, you said in WhatsApp because I use uh, one on my yeah phone. I use. <laughs> I but use Frank's uh, phone right now for doing the this lives. live, so um, make live. It is very pleasant name. Yeah. Winter. Just like, even no matter how hot here, if your name is winter, it feels like, <laughs> like cold. There is no rush. Okay, thank you for understanding. Yeah, because my phone, I Frank right now use my phone and I use his phone to do live. So I don't understand why sometimes I've used my phone to do live a Wi-Fi connection, but this I've almost had trouble. <laughs> So you are invite everybody for for karaoke on Saturday night. Okay. I need everybody on the, the van going to the Gigantes trip. Oh. Mary, I, I Tony, every my... every all the expats. <laughs> no, that's fun. I keep my house cold as winter in summer. <laughs> So do I. Yeah, I mean, same here. Sometimes I've, I've said that, oh my God. I mean, every time, like, for example, I'm just going outside, like, 
leaving Rome for a while and then going back into Rome, I just gave a hard time to Frank. Oh my God, how you can stand this cold? Like I said that uh, before, I tell Frank, maybe if we were to go to America and then it's snowing there, I couldn't, I, I couldn't, you know, how, how cold it is because even in Asia right here, I cannot uh, stand too much cold. But so far, I will try to be used with that. I like internet, I don't know. So now, but I'm now, I'm back. So let's see. So also Winter said, advance an early birthday to you. My dear. Looks like we are connected now. Yeah, I'm back. That, that I was worried sometimes if I do do live and then the connection is not good. Yeah, I'm back. I'm back again. Sorry for that. Again, welcome to the Philippines. <laughs> Does it always happen? But actually, here in being here in Iloilo, it's much more much better than we were in Bacolod because when we were there, most of the time we owe out uh, every end of the month. We don't have internet connection for like three days, sometimes one week. So it's hard. My problem long here is. I cannot use if I didn't have, like for example, uh, blackout. Even though I have a battery on my phone, I can still do. I can still do a live because I didn't have my data. My data connection here also is very slow. So I need to go somewhere to you know to do. If I have plan to do live. Dang it, my earring. Ow! See that my 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 air is you know I don't know what's the what is the cause of you know sometimes your ear is you know like a ringing too bad it almost he experienced that too right. Reading backwards too hard, viscous, maybe too much flour. Better with the self rising flour or all purpose flour. And do not overmix biscuit butter, just a uh, lazily mix. What it means is like lazily mix. Lazily. Lazily mix. What is that? Just like a little. Yeah, softly. Not. Yeah, not, not, not too much. Yeah. Ah. Gentle mixing. Maybe. Ah, now I'm now winter because at the time I use a mixer. It's like. But bad. That's my bad. Okay, now I know. I'm gonna try that again. But slowly. I never use the the electric mixer. I just like use a manual mixer for that. I'm gonna try. And then I'm gonna mix another gravy with uh, milk and what else? Maybe use spam or a bacon. I'm not sure, but it's not hurt. It's not, it's not hurt, but so sometimes I'm just, uh, uh experienced that some kind of you know ringing especially like after uh what do they call that tinnitus swimming what where you get ringing in your ear yeah I there's a name for that it's tinnitus tinnitus i believe don't i mean i don't i don't, I don't guess know, I don't know my head. so yeah i've just experienced this most of the time like for example we do swimming we do swimming in the in the water pools, right? It's too deep, so I try to, you know, to swim very deep also. And then when after that, a couple of days, I've just, you know, experienced 
ringing on my ear. I'm not a master baker. Just a few things we like. We like biscuits. Just mix to get the ingredients with so you don't see the dry powder but don't beat it smooth. Okay, got it. Like I said, at the time we just mix it, it I'm just over it because I've used an electric mixer. If your ear is ringing, answer it. <laughs> boom, boom, boom. <laughs> Smart. We need a drum roll sound. Like, <laughs> for every time that he does that, we can just press the drum roll sound. You don't use the mixer for the biscuit or corn. We can do this sound. <laughs> I did that. I do that next time. Smart. If my is if my ear is ringing, I can answer it. <laughs> Actually, it's hard to. So far here in the supermarket, I don't see much uh, a corn a cornbread. Ding, ding. so yeah listen learn while i do mix the when i do the biscuits i didn't use a uh, mixer maybe i could use the but we didn't have that um yeah mostly i use mixer for for everything if i do mash potato <laughs> i do use the mixer to you know smash all the potatoes sweet potatoes both sweet potatoes and and potato oh actually i've just missed going to you know if i'm just going back to the market I try to buy the sweet potato because I think Sarin mentions that she just missed to eat the kamoti delight. Means a potato delight. Just a sweet potato mixed with uh, cream, cream and I think condensed milk, some butter, something like that. So Sarin, she really liked that kind of of uh, snacks. Or appetizer. What is the weather today? You think? Beautiful. It's Show not, the phone. It's not the it's not Magal on today. No, in fact, you can, you're on live. You can carry the phone out onto the porch. You're mobile, silly. The mobile. There. The mobile. There, the mobile. The mobile. So. I just give you an idea what should look like our house here. So that's my painting that I just really like. Where's that? Didn't, didn't. A friend of mine had ringing of his ears. But, uh, what's it? Tin, 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 Turns out, it turns out that he needed a doctor gently here. Uh, shout out from SNR. Oh, you are an SNR guy. Hello. Hopefully, we can going back and SNR soon. Just kidding. So, uh, 86 in Iloilo City right now. I am the the weather. So, yeah, that's the the house our neighbor and uh, our porch and this is a frank you know uh, yeah well you're doing good you're getting a lot of live action today yeah uh the, from his and r he said hi mom fell i'm frank you get the wi-fi no, 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 the signal is uh hold on sony is you come here sit in your chair oh uh, yeah i'll be is there a chance? So yeah, I think that's. that's you want me to him. put it back that's in him. there? Yeah. Yeah. That's sit him. Down and I'll... That's him.
uh, what is it? Signals regarding. I lost you again. I will try again later. Don't know if I can make tomorrow with Michael. Sad, sad, sad. We'll try though. But rewatch yeah, it. Yeah, yeah. You, you can still watch it if you are not uh, uh available able. Yeah. able to watch that tomorrow. So yeah, you can still watch that recap for our live. You're doing really good today, sweetie. I'm impressed. Thank you look good. You got good lighting. Thank you. Yeah, you like open. I said, during the daytime, that's like this. You open the curtain, and you know that's uh, it's a natural. I used to use the light in the room, but still though, I like the. I do too. All right, so we're subscribed to Sunny. I like the fresh uh, sunlight outside. You know, that's an eleven ten. Yeah, I think uh, Smurf, I was lost my signal because a uh, porch is already, you know, a little too far, far away from, from the uh, Wi Fi. So our Wi Fi is downstairs. And also, the reason why sometimes it's hard to get a, a really good uh, signal here. Real quick, and I hate to interrupt you live, but real fast. Da Walaka in Chidi Si Luka. I don't know. Translate that. Da wala ka in chindi si Lok how. He said that uh, Lok he don't uh, Lok he don't understand. I don't know. The signal seems to be much better now. Yeah, because uh, like I said, that the porch is a little bit away from the 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 Wi-Fi. So now I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back. I'm back to be back. Yeah, I have five likes. Yay! What is your internet provider? Uh, PLDT. PLDT. Regarding Michael's live stream, did he set a new time and date for that or will be uh, decided later? Um, Tell yeah. us tomorrow at 10. Uh, it's, still, it's still the same time. Uh, 10 o'clock. He likes to get that uh, American audience. Mm -hmm. I think tomorrow I'm 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 a lot more nosebleed because of this too. You'll let us talk. <laughs> <or> whatever. <laughs> no, because remember that in every time, just like I always said it. Ah, oh, I'm just you know a little bit. I'm not nervous, but some kind you just like you don't know what to say, something like that. But. When you start, uh, you and Mike start to talk, just like more talk, 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 talk. So that's why sometimes if Mike don't ask me some questions or you don't ask me some questions, something like I'm just be quiet and listening to you guys talking. So it's fun. So like I said, I have a lot of nosebleed tomorrow for, <laughs> for two men that spoke, you know, English. Tomorrow will be an interesting day for me. I have a video job interview at 1 p.m. Oh! Good luck, sir. Good luck to you. I enjoy interview. I am 100% sure you, you got it. Did PLDT provide your Wi-Fi niche or uh, repeater? Ah, ano lang siya. Di wala kami... Wala kami, ano, wala kami, Mish, ang pinaka, ka, ano, nila, ka, ang box downstairs. Then, we use the cable wire from the PLDT box through the TV. So, the TV is, we are not using the Wi-Fi signal for the TV. Yeah. Ethernet. So, we use a wire. So, we just only use the air. Oh, B, real quick. What was the name of that small bill to try to do the reservation? I was going to look it up. I'm glad she's back. District 21? District 21? Yeah, I think. Be asked, Frank, what is the name of the the place that you want to be get a reservation for? Well, you can do it. 25. She can definitely do it. Yeah, maybe I can do it. Reservation. And we expected a lot of, you know, uh, guests. TikTok business account. Welcome to your TikTok business account. They must be L. Yeah, L's done something with our TikTok. We're a, a business now. 
I hope it goes well with interview. Thank you very much. Yeah, you can do it. Yeah. So like I said, it's uh I'm just confirming it's just a district twenty one because I think it's just easy to make a reservation. Yes, she said district twenty one. Yeah, Smallville District twenty one. Okay. So yeah. I think I seen it there. I know, but if we're going to have Mary and a few other people, it wouldn't hurt to do a reservation. Yeah. Like I said, you invite... Uh, whoever. Whoever who comes. So, like, so 100% B is going. Right, B? You're going. Because without you, who is seeing the Dancing Queen? <laughs> and I think if Mary is going, Mary is also do uh, some... Uh, you know, uh, karaoke, she good in it. Me, uh, let's see. I think if I have a couple of beers, <laughs> good luck. They have a several hotel chain with KTV rooms. I can make reservations for you guys. Uh, I think me and Frank can, can handle that. If we're not, I'm gonna send you a message, but for now, Frank is you know, trying. So, because I like the idea that if, if we do, you know, KTB or just like we're going with Yanka, there's a lot of people there to, you know, it's so crowded. So, it's much better that uh, we can do some kind of uh, private that we are not sharing with some other group because i see that i think one of my nieces before they going some of private ktv bar rooms with her friends and they get drink there that they don't uh uh, uh what's called this compete for some other uh karaoke people and it's fun if we're only a, a group, if they have some, you know, people, it's, it's okay, yes. There's one in their version 21, District 21, or Smallville 21. They have several rooms for bigger crowd. They have the biggest one for 3,500 or for key with food included. That's consumable for three hours. Again, when you get done with your live, we'll yeah. take care of it. No rush. Well, I hope no rush. We're gonna we're gonna check that. It's not later. about the cost. We're gonna check that later. Yeah. Baya. <laughs> now you're not going to Baya B. Actually, I like the I like also the name and the name of B. It's like Baya Baya. Some of the rose, Bea Rose, because I have uh, a person that I know, the name is Bea Rose. Saga the NC, Sir Frank Mumfell. Saga US. Saga US, he Frank. He is a pure Americano. He's a real Kano. Yeah, we don't, we, yeah, we do that with my gay guy friends sometimes they're fun to do ktv with yeah like i i actually i i tell dr frank that you know uh gay persons is the most uh you know uh have a uh, what's called this uh uh funny you know growth that if you go out pa shout out naman mam pesa baby ko si yan anthony ba Hello, baby. See you and Anthony. Bawa. Hello, hello to you. Hopefully, we can see you too. Your papa is really work hard. What's that? I like your. I like. I like your name. I like the name of your baby. See you. Sian Anthony, Sian Anthony's. 
sometimes they they use as sian 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 yeah b he is a working at uh snr our guy there that though helping for some groceries sometimes actually snr people they are really i know they are friendly there Tapos mo na sugat, imo ba, Tabi? I like this ma. I like this ma. Ha, ha, ha. Oh. Yeah, Siren and Johanna, they are whole day. Whole day in school. Even though we are close in school, I will not let them to go home for lunch. Manang Joy was just prepare them uh, lunch every morning and then they don't need to go home every every lunch time. Because the gasoline is so expensive to go back and forth and you know we need to be we need to be um tipied. Tipid, tipid for the gasoline. I'm getting her back to six. That's what I'm saying. Keep, keep it up, man. You're, How you're... old I am? I am 41 years old. 27. <laughs> I'm 41. Wala pa magod sa school pa lang siya. Ah, okay. So, bali half day. Half day lang siya. Sana all half day. Kami, a whole day kami. And then last night, we're... That's why last night, uh, a little bit late to do sa uh, live because after school, and then after tutor, we went, they went to Taekwondo training because we will absent for three weeks. So they have upcoming three events for Taekwondo. So they need to going back to training. And I think we are invited to an uh, August uh, Korean, Korean uh, tournament. How about Sir Frank? Frank's is 53. I 53. 52. He's turning 53 this Saturday. Tomorrow. No, tomorrow is a Friday. Oh, yeah. Day after tomorrow. <laughs> yeah, the day after See, tomorrow. See, I'm getting old. <laughs> <laughs> it's starting to show. So, yeah, I'm 41. He's 52. He's turning 53 on Saturday, and I'm turning 42 on July. She looked younger than her age. Yeah, I'm look uh twenty one. <laughs> Just like the lady in the market, so I'm asking, "Mom, how old are you?" And I said, "I'm I'm twenty one." Mm, and they said, "Really? I'm twenty one plus twenty." And then he laughed. Ad wow, advance happy birthday, Sir Frank. Uh, that uh, Sunny said. Thank you, thank you, sir. When you That's get done today, day. I've got the uh, number of the District 21 to try to make the reservation. Okay. Get you, get you. Invite them all. Yeah, be easy. Smurf, if you're there, you're invited. <laughs> get on you, a plane. Yeah, you missed you miss on last uh, week. I think this Saturday you don't miss again. You need to be there. Get a plane ticket, something like that. And Catherine, if you're, if you watch this Saturday, girl, you're absent again. Yeah, Zik is scheduled from twelve forty to five ten in the afternoon, which is more convenient for me. We don't have to rest in the morning. Yeah, I like that schedule though, but. Uh, my kids is, yeah, whole day. 
Their schedule on Monday is 7, uh, uh, 7 in the morning to 5. But Saturday to... Ay, uh, Saturday. Uh, Tuesday to Thursday is... Uh, I think uh, 7.30 to... Uh, no, Thursday to... Because Saturday and Iwana, they have a different schedule. So Thursday, both of them, they are going to school at 7.30... That's the class start at 7.30 until 4 o'clock in the afternoon. And then Wednesday, uh, your assignment schedule is, is still the same. 7.30 to 4. And Johanna is 5 o'clock. And then during the Thursday, uh, Siren is 7.30 to 5. And Johanna is uh, 7.30 to 4. But mostly Siren until 6 o'clock sometimes because she has a tutor after class uh remedial class and tutorial class and then uh hey uh just because it says b right it says lol fell can do a lap dance for you and so i said so can you in my mind's eye right i'm a naughty boy here Right, but then, and then she says, ha, 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 you're going to be sleeping on the couch tonight when Fel reads that. Actually, yeah, I read it. So. <laughs> oh, you read my stuff? I read it. You use my phone, duh. Oh, yeah. Until, pati ka be. It's going to be your wedding anniversary also, right? Yes, uh, on 26, Six. we having a uh, two years wedding anniversary. Wow, good catch, Winter. Yes, my God, she is on point. I'm I watch impressed. your beautiful wedding video clip sometime. Sometime, March is March, I recall, yes. Yeah, a double celebration for the... Birthday and the wedding anniversary. Right, my dear? Yes, my dear. I love you. And by the way, a lap dance is harmless. That's why I'm just... <laughs> Hope makavisit ka muliwat sa SNR, ma'am. Hihi, hi, mapapicture lang man ah. Hihi. Hi. Okay, actually, we always... Oh, they want a picture yeah. with us? Yeah. Oh, okay, okay, definitely. Uh, we were always going as at SNR every... Once every two weeks. Uh, once a, sometimes like... once a week, sometimes twice a week. Uh, no, no, no. Sometimes, if, it depends. Oh. I'd be honored. I'm flattered. I love it. Yeah, actually... Hey, when, the other day, we did a picture with the bench. Yes. The, the, the crew at the bench. Yes. And then we did a pictures with the women at the Kashika. I don't know how to Kashika, say that. Kashika, yeah, you're famous. No, you're famous. I mean, I'm famous. You're famous. Mm -hmm. So, like I said, yeah, we're going at SNR. Maybe after we out on supply, we're going back there again at SNR. Don't worry. We're always there. Because some of the product that we like is there in SNR that we cannot find that in some other grocery store here. So Buy in bulk, baby. SNR. Buy in bulk. We always buy. Actually, that's the one thing that we're going there because we out of tissue that we really like. So... To SNR. Oh, Winter, you're so sweet. You even remember their anniversary? Yes, B. Like I told you, uh, she's my mom. <laughs> I appreciate her kindness. As always, smart. Like I like. Frank always said that uh, there's a lot of you know people who just uh, struggling life. So we are not rich. Right, my dear? We are not super rich people, but I like Frank's idea that... Uh, We'd be a lot richer if we weren't going around helping everybody. Yeah, <laughs> like I'm you kidding. Said, uh, we always share our bliss to some people that who need some. There's not really... I need a lot of good karma, everybody. So, right, I'm paying it forward, right? I feel like if I do nice things for uh, starving animals yeah. and, and... Actually, before needy, before this before this YouTube thing, something like that, even we were in in Bacolod, we already started, you know, helping some people there. I did this anyway, just not on video. Yeah, now we ham it up. Yeah. Like, ah... Smurf and Winter, you're going to get your bomb over here so we can have fun together. Yes, that's a good idea, B. I think Winter... And B can get her bum over here. One, oh, one, day, ah. one day, Winter can also visit in Philippines, right? 
tampo yung ona siya ni Phil karon. <laughs> you know if Frank frustrated, you know what's the reason why? Smart know that, B know that. You know that. Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Poor Frank is in the dangerous zone. <laughs> the danger the, the, zone. No, no, no. Poor Frank is in the doghouse now. <laughs> yeah. I feel like I'm more like in the danger zone, like on uh, uh, Top Gun. Yeah, actually, m mostly just like, again, I repeat it that how Fel can handle Frank, although some kind of, you know, the way how she talk, the way how he talk, the way how, you know, Flirt. You're you flirt or something like that. He always say that, but actually, many times I told him, okay, you can go to Pampanga, you can do whatever you want. You can you want someone, girl? I am loving you, but <laughs> why do you always say Pampanga? You know that makes them think I want to go to Pampanga. Like I because I she always nervous. mentions that. But you know what? When we were I mentioned that before I came but to the Philippines. But just like I said, boo. For me, it's not working because we went in Thailand. I go with him. He do is working in the circus like. Even he cannot stand to lock Not me. one flirt, did I? Not yeah. one flirt. So, I talk shit no matter I, what I said, don't I talk it. shit when it's harmless. <laughs> I talk shit when it's harmless, but don't, then... Don't listen to him. He's just like more talk, but... <laughs> no game. Yeah. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I know you. All though. talk, no action. Yeah. Just like I always said that, like I said, okay, do it first, and then if you do it, I believe you, but no... I don't think so. I, I believe you. All you said. At be the potato smasher someday. That's the plan. A smart crusher loves to dance and I love to sing. So with Frank and Phil and all their subbies, we will have an orchestra. Yeah, you're right. Actually, it's a lot of fun. Both of you come here in Philippines. You know, we go hang out. <sighs> oh, you can tell I feel right. You can take me a picture of it's live right now. You can join if you want. Winter sounds awesome. Dancing is great fun. It's like a uh, hustling spell. And I don't know how to dance. Frank did. Even though, like, uh, if you see my dance uh, moves, I'm not really good in it. But Frank, he always mentioned, I don't know how to dance, but it just, sometimes we just play music. He was there, uh, do some silly dance. He's really cute while doing some uh, little moments like, <laughs> so that's cute. Say hi to Maribel. Hi, Belle, and live right now. You can join. Okay. If you guys watch, uh, oh, very much. Junger Zoni, if you guys watch Archer. Archer, I like yeah. Archer. I used to watch Archer a long time ago. It's a cartoon. It's one of the Adult Swim cartoons. Adult cartoons. I know. We watch adult cartoons just like an American Dad. Yeah. Right? A family Guy. Family Guy. Uh, Marpy and what's that? Ricky and Rick and Morty. Rick and Morty. You'd like Archer too. We haven't. We haven't. I seen never it. see Archer still yet. Uh, I think in Texas they say something like that cowboy is all hat and no. LOL. All That's hat and no pitoy. Yeah. Hi, Bell. Maribel. I'm stuck. Gano ko dai gado nag live ako kay. I think it's the perfect timing to do live. Last night, uh, nag live ako, but. Uh, Who knew? This yeah. 10 o'clock's been pretty good. You need to remember that. Yep. I think it's. I Every like other the idea day, of my. You won at 10, won yeah. at. Yeah. Hi. It's just Belle. Hello from Winter. Hi, Belle. How are you? Yes. So, did you hear that, uh, Belle? Maribel's on the next video again. Yes. Remember, I just did a video, Watch the video. tonight. Uh, Ivan Tony is there. And then Soulmates. Frank was invited you guys again she on Saturday. She said she can't right here. Huh? She, she can't? Said, yeah, she's saying sorry. Pass. Baby loves go. Tony, Tony won't let her go by herself. 
Maybe Tony is getting well before that Saturday. Sa Saturday pa man to. Yeah, adult cartoons. They are so funny, aren't they? Um, Bob's Burgers. Ah, I also watch a Bob Burgers. You I know, have they, the shirt. Yeah, they also have a movie, actually. Yeah, the Bob's, yeah, Burgers, the Bob's movie. Burgers movie. So we watch that, and I like that movie, though. Cartoons. I'm a Simpsons fan, too. The Sim the, yeah, the, fa the Simpsons family. South Park. Oh, man. Oh, uh, the South Park. Sometimes I don't like to, you know... Especially Saturday tonight. What are you, what are you watching, Mama? And no, this not even though it's a cartoons for it's a cartoons, <laughs> but it's not for for kids. And then she she just gave me her no, it's cartoons. It's for kids. No, the the looks is for kids, but the you know the language mm. is not. It's not appropriate for your age. So out out all hat and no cattle. That's what Marv said. I don't know. Oh, he's, the, cow, the cowboys. He's going to get us banned. <laughs> we need to quit, quit talking to him. <laughs> we like it. He's getting too risque. Whatever. It's, we need our viewers. This, we, this or, is, we need our view hours. This is an adult. I'm just kidding. This is an adult, right? Yeah, it's an so, adult live. You said it. Um, we didn't. Uh, adults only. Yeah, for just adults only. So. Uh, we are not really all talking. topics are on the table. You Dude. have, yeah, the the Bob's Burger. Yes, uh, he has that. The Bob's Burgers, because B said you have the shirts. I'm jealous. Yeah. Yeah, color red, color red. Me, I, I, right? can, this is I red. can take it off and give it to her. Ah. Tadlong. Karon ma. <laughs> I'll take off my shirt and just give it to her. Do it. Maybe she likes the smell of it like do you it, did mine. Do it right now. A smart crusher, yes, that's what I was trying to remember that saying. But Frank, you brought up the topic flirt, but no follow, no follow up. <laughs> You sometimes you be. Busy. I'm all game, no gamble. Just like, I'll tell you what. <laughs> yeah, that's why sometimes I've asked Frank. You know, sometimes she don't. You don't know how to be being serious though. Just like sometimes she be serious. You know. It's like. I didn't realize our lives when we're supposed to be entertaining is when I'm supposed to be serious though. Is that what you're trying to tell me? Is it D O? Is it D O O D O? Duh. Do. Do. Don't! No! Don't! No. That's like uh, the Homer Simpson. Don't! Who is that? Homer Simpson, the Simpson. Bart, Bart Simpson's, Simpsons dad, yeah. the fat guy with the yeah. donut. Don't! Don't! I like the American dad. <laughs> I like Roger. Who is Roger? The alien on American Dad. Ah, yeah. Yeah, he's got that. He's got that. Actually, like I said, uh, when you start to show me that these cartoons. The, yeah, these cartoons, I've said that, oh my god, they have different kind of cartoons for adults. I don't know that. So Smart. That is, so that is why uh, I'm just into the One Piece, you know, for most on a uh, Japanese and mostly Japanese cartoons. I still like the One Piece. We haven't got all the way through that yet. Like it's I been said, so busy. Uh, they have a new uh, episode for that release, but it's a cartoon. It's still cartoons. It's not the 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 one that we just watched. That that's Homer. Say Homer. What? Well, yeah. That's what I said. Don't. No, don't. don't. No. Don't. don't. I don't. like the hair of his wife. Oh, Marge. Then, yeah. <laughs> Marge Simpson. <laughs> the Simpson fam. Roger is hilarious. How are you doing? How are you doing? No, he just asked uh, Belle. He's taking care of uh, her hubby, Tony, because they mentioned they were having us. They're sick. They have flu, I think. Bakalbala Bell, ano? Uh, ginger tea. And um, they have that just like ginger tea with honey, or maybe take a more uh, vitamin D with zinc. 
I was just saying that, but I'm not, I'm, I'm, I'm not actually. I'm not taking any. I just started watching One Piece. So do you like it, B? But Frank does have the real deal with singing and dancing. He is good. I thought when I watched you a couple dance, I think Frank could really know how to dance like a uh, fox fox rot and and stuff i i could learn those i could learn to dance i think i like to dance like that yeah actually, I mean, you know a lot of older people do it in the in america like you don't dance your whole life and the next thing you know when you get a little older you kind of like evenings out the next thing you know like a lot of beach dancing and uh yeah yeah like i said that's how we get women in the in America. When you're an old guy, you gotta, yeah, you gotta like, dance. like I said, it ain't about looks anymore. It's about how you can how still move. Can like my mom, my mom, my mom. She is really good in singing. So, uh, uh some of my uh, my relatives in my mom's side, they always tell me that you know what, your mom when she was a kid, she was always joining for the singing competition during the fiesta, something like that. And then my dad is really good in both singing and dancing, especially the the cha cha. And then what uh what is the other one? The 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 the, 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 the very fast uh, ballroom. This mm. is really like because Mama and Jane, the one that my aunt that who was are you dying. familiar with line dancing? No. Nah. Okay, it's uh, usually country western, right? But there's others, but. Basically, everybody's lined up next to each other, and you do the same kind of move. Like, you might turn to the right, step forward, step forward, and you just do this rhythmic pattern throughout the whole song, and it's called line dancing. And there's a whole variety of different line dances to learn. It's a lot of fun. Line dancing. Work on it. Uh, catch the topic. I'm okay, just can't catch the topic. Ang topic, Bill, anything lang ko na nang mabasahan mo. That's our topic. Uh, we're topic about do dancing right now. Uh, However, working on it, LOL. Uh, yeah, I love the action. Marge, be, be hives. I expect that to warm up. Tell, Honest, tell Maribel, the, uh, the idea for today is you bitch about your, your live-in partner in Ilongo. That's the topic. Hmm? You complain about your live-in partner in a long go. I'm not complaining. No, no, she. So, yeah. You complain yeah, about, about you complain <laughs> about your live-in partner in a long go. In That's long the go. topic. Uh, expect the honors to come at any moment. I thought you may know already. Yes, we older folks do take classes though. I haven't since free wedding. Always meant. Uh, always meant to do always meant to do always meant to um hasn't done it but always meant to in other words again everybody the older you get right we're not really good looking anymore but if you if you got like if you haven't got hip replacements or bad knees and you're on crutches and shit or cane the fact is if you can still boogie and shake it's a lot of yeah, fun it's a good just, activity to just get like, your blood. just like i said it to you that my my aunt that who has died recently this mama engine and tatai when they were teenagers life they're always also uh, dancing, up dancing a storm. just like a uh, boogie yeah. cha cha they are always together just like all my aunties and titas hey, you know what your dad and your uh, aunt they always uh, join for the dancing for up the a storm dancing, right yeah. so that is why i tell i give a hard time to my dad that ah oh, that's the reason why my aunt Mama Injun, he don't have a boyfriend because you are always around whenever, wherever she go. Do you guys ever interested in uh, joining Zomba? Yes. Uh, Frank. We ha I haven't done it yet, but I would be interested to do it. It looks a lot of fun, actually. I would Zumba. Zumba. I think I can go if Frank I tried to goes. Zumba in Thailand with the, the whole Thailand community. As Marv said, and I got out zoomed by a little four year old girl. Smurf said, I only dance uh, creative freestyle. <laughs> Same here. Same with Frank. I've always looked at it as a cotton candy. The hair. 
Hamula Mon Komag Alumni Parade, Mon. Huh? Hamula Mon Komag Alumni Parade, Mon. Line dancing is fun. Phil would enjoy the line dance. Oh, damn right, you would like the bus stop. Ah, uh, he just asking if he can borrow the the ATB during the parade of uh, alumni. We took a few ballroom dancing classes before. So you may say no. For our wedding, long, long time ago. Hell no. In galaxy far, far away. <laughs> we took a few ballroom dancing classes before our wedding. Long, long time ago in a galaxy far, far away. That's Star Wars. <laughs> yeah, this is winter. That's fun. Haha, <laughs> don't mind me. Manog, manog pamati lang ako. <laughs> yeah, kadlaw lang tayo, Bell. I think they have one in Plazuela. The what? The Zumba? I also took Philippine folk dance classes in college. That was fun. Frank and Phil, the girls should do that if they have time. Uh, someone. Yeah, I actually, more often than not, women love the, the line dancing. Some men will still do it, myself included, but for the most part, the women will be out there all night long. Just mm. do, 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 one after another, after another, after another. After another. It's just, Super country western thing. Actually, um, thing. actually about folk dan uh, uh Philippine folk dancing classes in college, something like that. Actually I just learned I before when I was in elementary because you are required if you are grade five and grade six, uh, mostly if you have uh 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 what you call this uh elementary day. So from grade from kindergarten to grade four Four, they do dance just like a modern dancing but if you're grade five and grade six you need to do uh do a folk dance uh so i was dancing um uh, i was remembered tinikling that the most one that i've never forget because i always have trouble during our practice because tinikling is very it's very hard to use the bamboo two bamboos that so you you need to be careful how do we how you step that's a very, very, it's very, very, for me, it's very difficult how to, to do the nickling dance. And actually, we have, there's a lot of uh, uh, Philippine folk dance that, you know, uh, easy to learn. And most of they have, they are also a uh, tinikling, and then they also have used the, if you remember that B, they use the, the, they use something that they, they put in their finger to make it sound and then they also used a coconut shell to you know to but i don't remember what the name of that uh dance that's a good idea there winter yeah actually johanna when they're celebrating uh united nation the dancing as uh, one of the filipino folk dance so they are wearing a uh, traditional, uh, a festive, festive costumes of the Philippines, and then they do uh, a folk dancing. Enjoy for. I enjoy folk dance. I also like learning square dancing as a kid. They don't have that in school anymore here in US with my kids. Did you familiar that the square dancing as a kid? <laughs> now the tinikling music is in my head. Hello, well, you know what? Whether you can still, you know, put a tinikling music and then you can, you know, you can learn how to, you know, to practice without using the 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 bamboo. Because my instructor, my instructor before he he said that, that uh, disclose your eyes and do this, do that. Imagine. Uh, the way how you step that they have the the bamboo there to make sure that you know so for me just like 
I'm stuck doing that because, you know, I'm not really, like I said, I'm not really interested in dancing. I'm just more fun to, you know, do some sports. Even though basketball, sometimes Frank uh, impressed that we how wow, how you can shoot the ball, something like that. So mostly I'm more on sports. Any kind of just like I can do. I think the only things that I can do is the tennis. It's so hard. The the tennis and what else? The the billiard dart is just for me it's just easy. Easy to learn and the golf. Before I would just hesitate that when Frank uh you know you're good at all sports, really. You're sports. You're sportsman. It's just like I said, I uh, I'm not good in dancing, but I just preferred more in you know, in sports. So yeah, I'm a sporty woman. You're incredibly good at wearing a bikini. No. Yeah. Oh yeah. I'm not. No. Oh yeah. And I do like you know. I just I mentioned to you. Allah. Mount do mountain climb. I like climbing yeah. in the mountain. My God, that's my my number one favorite, 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 favorite. Yes, tennis. I could thought I tried. My parents even gave us tennis lessons, but I can play racquetball or I could pass maybe uh, pickleball. I think Frank he just play a uh, racquetball, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And even the tennis is a little bit, you know, good in in tennis. Volleyball is fun. Yeah, actually, I also play volleyball. But I'm not a good player, but I play volleyball because I'm also fun, uh, fun of volleyball. Actually, I'm so much addicted with that. Before, uh, before they have here is a uh, the name of that is a Grand Freak. So, uh, different country was just compete here in Philippines. Yeah, the Philippine, Philippines, Cuba uh korea brazil and italy poland something like that but i have a two except for the philippines i also have a two foreign country that i've just really supported and i'm just really addicted for those women that who just play for the italy team i like mauricia cacciatore and anne capri and then for the brazil team i like uh, leila barros uh she is a volleyball player and a swimmer and she was married with a i think a uh, football player of brazil uh what is that it's funny i'm six foot tall but i'm terrible of uh spiking i think you're good in basketball spiking is for me i like i i like those spiking I wish that about. I wish that basketball would be more popular for young ones in field. Enjoy watching USA Major League Baseball, baseball, not basketball. I wish that baseball would be more popular for young ones in field. I agree. I enjoy watching US Major League Baseball. There are many Dominican, South African players, but not too many Pinoy. That's because uh, the game doesn't exist here. Yeah, I mostly, uh, they have still play baseball, but just only like inter-school competitions, but like a, Pilip uh, like a Philippine team, something like that. I don't, I don't know if they have there. They are more focused on boxing, uh, what else, uh, basketball, because basketball is very, you can go every place here in Philippines, you can see a uh, court. Even in some small barangays, they have a basketball court for, you know, uh, young and old can play basketball here. But basketball is really number one, I think, in Philippines. To be honest, I'm really not a big sport guy. It bothers me that such a huge uh, portions are thrown at people and stadiums. Ah, truly... You are not sporty guy also, Frank, right? But he just, uh, 
really watch. Uh, I would some... say that I agree with that comment 100%. Yeah. So much money could be used in such better ways. Yep. Actually, like I said, uh, there are sir, uh, a lot of uh, sports that uh, uh, just like uh, what the exact word I was looking. Just like, for example, you have some sports that uh, everybody that you know have talent for that can easy to to play or join something like that. But they also have some uh, sports that if you don't have money, um, sorry for you. Even though you like that kind of sports but if you don't have money it's difficult to you know it's like number one taekwondo you, do you like taekwondo but if you don't have much money to you know because taekwondo you need to pay for the trainer you need to pay for for uh everything everything it's belt promo, uh, uh belt promotion even the competition you need to pay everything is uh you need to pay Just like that we how you pay Kali or uh what is that uh football football is also uh a little bit expensive oh no a smart pressure oh no white men can't jump <laughs> joke lang <laughs> white, white men can't jump jump yeah joke lang i like that i like that but i like what they said joke lang good one winter i get the reference in america sports are like the new religion period sports heroes are almost uh worship yeah actually sometimes i feel bad for some especially here in philippines there are some players that uh they do their best especially student student player because i heard that one article that the the parent i think she uh, they were mad for the for the teacher because the teacher gave a hard time to that student because he has a low you know low grades and then he, he just uh uh gave the hard time to the kid that you know that the kids um we know that that not all the students or kids are you know smart like uh like my siren she is not really good in reading yet uh she know she easy to learn how to speak english but you know it's typical to her how to read so those uh teachers give a hard time to the player something like that how oh, you just focus on your on your on your uh sports blah 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 say they say that about the sports but she never realized that the kid though attend the training every day outside i think he is a track and field player so that's it the teacher it didn't ever realize how hard during the training time you know spend your time due to training you know just sweating a lot you know tired so they never 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 uh appreciate those uh kids uh efforts to you know to to do that kind of sports and uh, bringing the name of the school to compete but they still you know uh, didn't appreciate the effort of the kids i feel bad for some players that experience just like that if i was a parent i would just you know also uh talk to the principal oh, what are you teacher doing just like you know give a hard time to my kids that even though that he is not really good in school but my kids is uh trying his best to you know to to bring your to bring the name of your school to compete to the other school so it's so for me it's uh i feel bad for that here is almost okay as a child i learned the best way to understand reading is to read book on the subjects that i love find something that she really enjoy and get her books on that actually like i said to siren because most of the time she said that uh Mama, I, I, I feel I'm, I'm sad because um, I don't know how to read. She always said that she don't know how to read. But if you point the words and encourage her to read it, she can read. But she is not some kind of a fast reader. But she can do read. So I tell her, 
you know what when i was my age just like you i do the same i don't know how to to read because especially at the time uh my mom and dad it's too busy for 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 their for, for work so they don't have much time to you know to to teach me how to read something like that so she asking me so but how do you know how to read and i said uh even me siren i don't know but i was remember that uh when i was in grade three my classmates just give me a hard time they call me dumb because i didn't know how to read blah 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 so those a uh, negativity that they always uh said to me i use that as uh tools to you know to say myself that uh one of the uh, someday again i i know how to read so i've start to you know to read some comics if i don't understand the the words i was uh, asked to my mom what's the meaning of this how you can read this and then later on i figured it out that i've already you know uh know how to read surprisingly just like i told her that don't give up as long as you see the book if you see the words try to read it something like that so but i don't but i don't uh, uh pushing her too much to to read especially if i see her that she really uh upset so i just find a way that if she was interesting so i we have a lot of fun that if she really said mama can you do reading and then I volunteer that I, I I just read the first the first the first page or something like that and then the next the next page she can read but actually she, I'm just really impressed because at the time Frank uh, spent time with her to you know to to teach how to read the book so Frank uh, take one of the get one of the Doctor Seuss uh, books and try to read with her just like a week I think right so just a week and then after the after the one week that uh both Alzheimer and frank spent time together to read to read and after the following week uh all the book all the the what's the title the green green eggs and ham the one book that frank uh, uh try to to help her to read she can read even right now she can read all the books but she always said mama i don't know how to read there are some certain words that she can still struggle to read it but i don't believe that she don't really know how to read mm, that's really enjoy the quick talk on that hold on for myself i really enjoy short stories such about adventure or diving in the ocean i also work my way through all the astronomy book in the library the key is that the book has to be something that she really enjoys so it isn't work it becomes fun yeah actually she also have a uh, one book that has pokey tree so that's a that's a small book that given that she can read uh from the first first page to last page she can read that and she was always uh, get that book so mama uh, i can uh, i can read the story this uh, i use this book so uh, she also I think three books that she already uh, read that even though uh, because sometimes I'm just uh, teasing uh, try to test her that like for example she know how to learn that book and then a few 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 weeks or a month that she never touched the book and then I would I will get the book and try to to give to her and tell her to read that again if you still uh, remember how to read so she still can read it so like i said i don't really believe that she don't know how to read for her long because oh, i don't know how to read so maybe just some kind of no maybe you just use that excuses because uh, you don't like to you know to to read but just like i said i like always a frank idea that uh, the best way to so what is the, the the goal again about reading the more the, the the goal to success yeah the goal to success is know how to read so he, that frank always said and remind for the kids uh, to everybody right reading 
is yeah, the key. Yeah, reading is the key to success. To success. It all starts with reading. Yep. If you can read, you can do anything. Yep. If you can write, it's no, no the read. same. You don't have to be able to write. If you can read, you can do anything. I feel hot now. My father always said that also. That's what Winter said. So yeah, right. Because for me, I don't, I don't believe that uh, reading is the key. He's always say yes. Franks always say that to everybody. Just like, just like, sometimes I'm just you know, because since I was, I also tell that Siren the story. You know what? Since I was uh, learn how to read, I've never stopped read 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 any book that i was you know see tagalog english any book some i sometimes enjoy scary stories as well so i would read edgar Allan Poe, also stephen king i think frank likes stephen king right but that would be more advanced and for later i heard that that story of the Stephen King's King I mean me mostly I'm not sure because winter is here mostly I like to again I like more with a you know love story because I am um, really like love story movies la a novel book more on love story a uh, true to life story mostly you can build on her hobbies or her straight to decide which book to get for her actually that's a good idea smart because actually frank buy bunch of boxes here they have started to you know to oh i'm so sorry fix it i was just showing you the thumbnail they did for our video hello you need a new Wow, Riz so much restaurant a reward winner for you receive the reward. I like it. That's a good one. So yes, Marp. So so far she like some of the books of Dr. Seuss because Dr. Seuss is really fun. Even me, uh those books is I first time to read. Even me, I'm just oh you look what this I read. This is really this is really fun. So even me sometimes I'm just uh Instead, Siren reads, and I'm gonna read first, and then after I'm done read, you're gonna read also. So, yeah, there are lots of books. Actually, I still have one of the books that I was read. It's about uh, people who just, but I still, I still start reading with this, but I'm not still done yet. So, so far, this is the book that I was, I was read. So as you see, this is my mark. So if I have uh, free time, I was just read this. So I think it's about when we starting to do you do YouTube. I just you know I don't have much time to to read, but I try my best to to read this, some of those boxes together. Actually, I've just read this because uh, when I was, uh, when my dad was died, I was just really um, affected. So there are some times that, you know, I'm always, you know, crying, stuck in the room, thinking about my dad all the time. So because at the time... Especially when I was work up with my past relationship, that's my dad just, you know, always with me, something like that. So when he was died, I'm just really too much affected. So I'm just, you know, out of, hold on, 
You're depressed. Yeah, I saw depressed. So that's the reason why the healing power of human connections in sometimes lonely world. That's what the book said. One way to do this, if she was a favorite movie, is get the movie in book form. This why she already understood the story. It will become that's a, a really very good suggestion. Read. Actually, I like that idea. Uh, good suggestions, Marv. But one of the other things she does there, right, is when she gets a book she likes, she read it, read it, read it, and then she almost memorizes it. <laughs> yeah, that's I'm not even sure she's, she's reading. Also good, she's also good in memorize, though. Once she, uh, she liked that... Uh, like green like, eggs yeah, and ham. Yeah, green eggs and ham, she liked that, even though she just, you know, uh, memorized it. Oh, you have that, too. She must, she almost memorized that whole book. Myself, this is uh, winter, myself... And my siblings were taught to read by my father with Dr. Seuss. But my own son were as in love with Dr. Seuss as me. As, as me. And my brother, oh, we were just scared of our father. I can... I can read it again. Myself and myself and my siblings were taught for read by my father. So that's like my mom. My mom mostly taught me how to read with Dr. Seuss. But my own son weren't as I in love with Dr. Seuss. As me and my brother and sister were, were just scared for me. So actually, mostly my dad when I was in a kid, my aunt. My dad didn't too much, you know, focus on ours, but my mom mostly he has a stick, and then she just sit down with you. She has a stick. And yeah, she's gonna she has beat a, you. She has a stick. Yeah, if you didn't have to, many times she did, and then she gonna. My mom just likes us very very strict before even absent in school, making sure that you don't absent. Never eat green eggs and ham. <laughs> I eat. I uh. uh uh, eggs and ham, but not green. I never eat green eggs and ham. I prefer bright yellow yolks. I do the same. Yep. <laughs> he said that. I'm more worried about the green on the bread when I make toast. Like if there's any more. I never eat green eggs and ham. I don't eat green bread. Yeah, you did. I didn't mean to. <laughs> He's ate the green green egg i green green bread my father is in his 90s and recently in hospital i dread i dread what you discuss fell serious topic to say bye on but i gotta go best you best to you all next time you should end it too you've got yeah. two hours uh it's okay uh uh winter actually uh, that one, she I, miss yeah. uh, I grabbed this opportunity to say thank you because uh, actually I already passed my time then so everybody that here right now thank are you gonna do me. it again tonight or uh, yeah I think tonight I gonna do um, it depends if I have what time I'm gonna post it maybe nine o'clock all right post so it. maybe nine o'clock tonight I'm going live again. So once again, thank you so much, guys, for having us today for my live stream. Love, Love you all. all. See you again tonight. Taking care of you all. Bye-bye.